Let us try another example. Example number 2. The angles about a point Q have the following observed values. 130 degrees 15 minutes 20 seconds, Arteta 1, 142 degrees 37 minutes 30 seconds, Teta 2, and 87 degrees 7 minutes 40 seconds, Arteta 3. Determine the most probable value of each angle. First step, we have to determine the correction to be applied. Let us find the sum of these angles, shall we say. Summation of theta is equals to theta 1, plus, theta 2, plus theta 3. By adding these value of measured angles, 130 degrees 15 minutes 20 seconds, plus 142 degrees 37 minutes 30 seconds, plus 87 degrees 7 minutes 40 seconds. The sum of the observed angles about point Q is 360 degrees, 0 minutes, and 30 seconds. However, we all know that the angle of full circle, is 360 degrees. If we are going to subtract 360 degrees 0 minutes 30 seconds from 360 degrees, which is the angle of full circle, we have a discrepancy in the observation, of negative 30 seconds. Therefore, the correction to be subtracted from each observed angle, is equals to discrepancy divided by the number of observation made, which is 3. Correction to be subtracted from each observed angle, is equals negative 30 seconds divided by 3, will give us, negative 10 seconds. Now, after determining the correction, we can determine the most probable value of each angle. We can take theta 1 prime as the most probable value of theta 1, theta 2 prime as the most probable value of theta 2, and theta 3 prime as the most probable value of theta 3. First, theta 1 prime is equals to theta 1 plus minus the correction. Since the correction is negative, we have to subtract. So, 130 degrees 15 minutes 20 seconds, minus correction of 10 seconds, will give us 130 degrees 15 minutes and 10 seconds, most probable value of theta 1. Second, theta 2 prime is equals to theta 2 plus minus the correction. Since the correction is negative, we have to subtract. So, 142 degrees 37 minutes 30 seconds, minus correction of 10 seconds, will give us 142 degrees 37 minutes and 20 seconds, most probable value of theta 2. Lastly, theta 3 prime is equals to theta 3 plus minus the correction. Since the correction is negative, we have to subtract. So, 87 degrees 7 minutes 40 seconds, minus correction of 10 seconds, will give us 87 degrees 0 7 minutes and 30 seconds, most probable value of theta 3. Now, let us check if our solution is correct. The sum of our most probable angles should equal to 360 degrees. So, 130 degrees 15 minutes 10 seconds, plus 142 degrees 37 minutes 20 seconds, plus 87 degrees 0 7 minutes 30 seconds, must be equal to 360 degrees. By computation, the sum of our most probable angles, is equal to 360 degrees. Since the two quantities are equal, the above solution is assumed to be, correct. <laughs>